Hey everybody, that's Drew Smithers, I'm Marcus King, and this is Spin Magazine. Mm. this tune um, with our buddy Angelo and Dan and we kind of started every session with like a therapy type interview with whoever I was writing with and uh, just to talk about what I've been going through and I talked about this moment where I came face to face I believe with uh, death or something that was posing its death and it just felt like a real um, wake up call or a warning or some some kind of foreboding truth that I was avoiding so um, I wrote this song about this faceless person that I saw around Printer's Alley. <laughs> and um, I talked about it a little bit in Garden and Gun, so if you subscribe to them, check it out. But this song called Dark Cloud it was like this. One, two...
like the second or third tune that we wrote for the record and uh, this is the first time we played it acoustic ever so I'm excited to do that for you Spin just for you this is a tune called uh, It's Too Late it goes like this one, two, two
Maybe that could be the reason that all this happened. Lord, I hope that never happens again. It's too late, and I hate to see you go. That's the first time you play that acoustic again. First take, swear. Yeah. Well, I guess uh, we got about one more for you, so we're gonna do uh, we'll do that Desmond Child one. Uh, Blood on the tracks. This is the first song I wrote with Desmond Child, and uh, I talked about it before in a couple of interviews, but he is uh, he is so himself all the time. And he's a beautiful human, and just his energy was contagious right away. And we wrote this song. It took us two days to write it because he really is so, uh, the way he works is so uh, just, he's very particular with it, and I really respect that. Um, it can be irritating at times, Desmond, if you're listening. He got mad at me for clicking my pen, so. <laughs> um, don't bring a clicky pen to a writing with Desmond, but. He's, he's, a, he's a wonderful human, and uh, we wrote this song and look forward to writing many more with him and with Dan. This song kind of talks about somebody's decision to, you know, keep pushing forward and trying to get themselves out of a crummy situation or just kind of taking an opportunity to get out of Dodge, and it's kind of up, up to you to decide how you want to receive the tune, but here it is. Two, two, uh, Getting up off 
very much. Thank you for listening.